What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. I really appreciate y'all tuning in today. Be sure, before you do anything, leave your comments down below. Let me know your favorite part of the vlog. Let me know your most quotable part of the vlog. Leave it down below because your boy is reading the comments. Also, be sure to always follow us on all our social media platforms, on TikTok, at The Levines. That's a family content. Lots of fun we have over there. And also, Instagram, the most amazing Instagram in the whole wide world, Queen D Fitness. Go and follow my wife because she's awesome. That's just what it is. Thank you so much for all y'all love and support that y'all been showing us. With all that being said, let's get this video going. Hopefully you enjoyed this long video. Let's go. What's going on? Come here, baby. I have to wash my bean. Jer Jordan, I just need you to um get a towel for me. Let's see if she's gonna do it better. Okay. What's right up, y'all? Great start to the day. I talked trash to my wife. Well, she was talking trash to me and was saying that I don't know how to bathe her right. You can't get it on her face. You're doing it wrong already. That's not good for Frenchies. See, she's still drinking it. It's just water. Excuse me. Water. Hmm. water. She's drinking the whole tub of water. And y'all leave a comment. Let us know who gave her the best bath. Look, look, look. Swapping it all up. What you gonna do when you rinse that off? No, see. Jordan's mm -hmm. helping me. Jordan's my helper. Okay. That's not fair. I didn't have any helpers. No helpers. No helpers. Yes, helper. <laughs> this is my twenty. Twenty. She looks terrified. Oh, yeah. Aww, you're such a hater because I'm doing such a great she job. She looks miserable. I'm doing such Look, a great job. She's slopping up all the There's dirt. There's nothing. There's nothing. nothing. <laughs> Look how scared she is. Look, I've oh. never seen her look like that ever. This is not relaxing at all. <laughs> <laughs> Look how serious they focus my wife is. Why are you so serious? Because I'm doing a bomb job. Oh yeah? Making up for what you didn't do. <laughs> yeah, y'all, she's been stinking you. I ain't gonna lie. She's been funky, funky, but what? <laughs> Get up private because it's been all dirt, dirt. Dreamy, like what? I don't know. Is it Frenchies or just puppies? When he's just so hardcore water driven. She's a thirsty girl. You ain't got no water in the tub. How, how could you make bubbles or suds? All right, mm -hmm. Jared, what, what I need do you to next? do is. There you go. Fine. Here come the soap. Here come the soap. Mm -hmm. All right, turn on the water drop. Make sure it's warm, okay? okay. See? Water in the bottom. Right, put some water in the cup. Look, the whole tub full of water. She's drinking. Uh -huh. Look, same thing. No, it's not. Same thing. Right there. <laughs> Make it a little cooler. It's too much. <laughs> so you didn't catch the, the shakes. I think mine was better. So leave a comment. Who gave Beanie the best bath? Mommy. Daddy or mom? Daddy. Thank you, son. Mommy. <laughs> See, she wasn't doing all the sniffling with me. She seemed very anxious. Got a lot of anxiety and stress. Look at her shaking and all that. She wasn't doing that with me. She's cold. Yeah, she wasn't cold with me. Mm. I mean, she looks comfortable. Oh, she looks comfortable. Who you turn? You turn on me? Try you off. Look at the back. Whoa, look at the back. 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 Look Not at all. There you go. 
See, when you calm down, she calms down. She look big right there. Doesn't she look bigger? Cause her hair is all fluffed up. Mm -hmm. Do you she don't see her face? Her face. She look like a grown old lady. I ain't gonna lie. I uh I said that jokingly. I was like, oh, when you supposed to wash her? And she was like, let's go now. <laughs> I'll give it to you, Wapas. You call me up. You ain't never moved that fast before. No. You used to take, oh, I'll wash it next you week, know. next month. Was it harder than you thought? No, it's just uncomfortable. The my back. But I'm saying, you know, when you did your dog, did you have to like hold him and off the I water like that? My dog, I took took her to do it professionally. Oh my god! Y'all don't understand how spoiled my wife was before we even met. Oh no, she's 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 she, 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 wow! Good job, mommy. Go outside. Out. Hey, boss. Hi. She came back when you walk. Yeah. Got a surprise for you. Huh? Got a surprise for you. What? You've been harassing me and bugging me for uh, a case. It took like super long. I know. And you annoyed me, like, to no end. Because I asked you to just pick out a case for me, and it turned into, like, a month-long thing. Open it up. Just for you, my love. Sailor Moon. Yeah, I wanted to get you some sentimental. Oh, thank you, babe. This is so cute. For your AirPods. Thank you, honey. You're welcome. Wait, wait, how does it close though? It goes on top of the case. Test see? it. And then it goes on top of the plastic oh. case. something bigger so it didn't get lost and like yeah. it's just prominent <gasps> i love it thanks huh? this is rare so i had to capture it because i'm not the best gift giver i love so it i try to get thought provoking because my wife has everything she you know she has all this high-end stuff i like it a lot babe thank you good Can and this is like the, to hold it right yeah oh yeah You're welcome. Oh, I love it. Yes, finally. Thank you. It only took like six months to come in. I know it took forever. <laughs> I was like, what is he, what is he getting? It came from overseas where your people at. Oh, yeah? Yeah, your cousins and them, they had text me and email me saying, oh, uh, sorry for the delay. You know, we're trying to make it special for family. Thank you. Yeah, your people made it and I had to wait for them to ship it on over across the ocean and all that. It's cute. You're trying to trigger me, but I'm not triggered. I don't care. Why not? Come on, give me my reaction. Date night with my baby, I love you. That's it? That's all you gotta say about your wife? Date night, I love you. That's it? Date night, I love you. Done with our, our date. I enjoyed myself. Thank you, baby. Yeah, thank you. My sugar mama. You paid for me? No, you paid for me, though. Would you be okay if you paid? Would it be an enjoyable date if you paid for me? At this point in our life, yeah. Do you want to tell the people what you told me earlier? So my wife, she tells me, I'm, I'm learning something new. I just learned it today for the first time. Been together almost 10 years and you never stop learning about the person you were. It's like, I don't even know who this person is next to me. Because I said, we was talking about uh, having to defend ourselves or 
a roast or you know whatever y'all call it in your area mm -hmm. when people teasing you as a kid I asked my wife I said what did you do when those kids went in on you and they say you had a big head or they say you're short what, what was your response what did you say anything to them in, in elementary school any time in life. Yeah, I just told them that. I was a tattletale. And? Y'all. Yeah. <laughs> you did not tell me this at the altar. You didn't, I didn't know I was getting married to a tattletale. Yeah. That is not the way to do it. Cause no. we were talking about our kids and you were telling Jordan, instead of responding or saying something back to these kids that say stuff about her, she said, go tell the teacher. And I was like, but you can't tell the teacher everything. Certain things is just between kids. Why not? No, she's she's seven. But, she could tell. But the, the teacher's not always gonna do stuff. That's like going to run to the police. They're not gonna always help. And tell your mama, and your mama will handle. All right, with your with with your mama don't help. No, not around mama, to help. Her, her mama is is me, and I'm gonna take care of it. How you gonna take care of the opportunity? The moment is gone. No, they, they they Indian style I'm on the ground. I'm gonna take care of it. But you can't teach the kids to grow up to be tattletales. They got look. I'm trying to teach these children to be self sufficient and to hold their own. And don't I didn't know that. I was mad to a whole tattletale out here in these streets. Don't do that. But how but you told then, as a little kid? Until then, you told on everybody. Mama can handle it. So as soon as somebody told you that you was oh hey shorty, hey hey big head, what they call you? What was the the worst thing somebody like ribbed you about? Um, we call it ribbon in the south. They didn't, I didn't really get made fun of other than my height, so like a midget or something. Okay, so yeah. what'd you say to that? What'd you do? Nothing, I just told the teacher. She's like, so-and-so called me this. And did they do something about it? Sometimes. No. I know, so it's pointless. Sometimes if you gotta just eat that. I don't know, I think, I, I don't remember, like, I'm sure I didn't I'm so, just... I'm so disappointed. Tell all the time. You a slit. Yeah, I am. And? I'm not a criminal, so I don't, I don't, I'm not. It's just an expression. Yeah, but I don't have like the, what is it? Code of the streets. Yeah, the uh, code I, of the streets. I know, I know, I know, I'm a, I know. I'm but I, I know, I'm not talking, look, I would take it up by saying that Just word. Breaking. I'm just disappointed in your childhood, you told your teacher when you was being teased. That's not something to, to tell about. You okay. tell for something serious. Something that you don't like what somebody's saying, you tell on somebody. So you live by street rules now? No, as a kid, I, I live by kid rules. <laughs> kid rules, if somebody's joking on you or, or picking on you, I didn't go run and tell the damn teacher. Cause oh. It's like, nah, you got to hold your own. I got to eat that or I got to say something back. Mm. Defend yourself. Mm. Put your hands up. I did do that as I got older. But when I was a little kid, then You yeah. told. Yeah. You, you told your mama, huh? Hell yeah, I told my mom. And your mom popped off, huh? Hell yeah, she did. See, history repeats itself. So look, <laughs> we all just repeating what, what, what our parents did for us. I ain't tell my mom nothing. My mom ain't have to pop off. I just, I had to eat that. I had to learn. Uh -huh. And that's why I, I am the way I am. Poo-poo. <laughs> I learned the hardest way. Hey baby, do you believe me? When I say I miss you so Some days you just wake up and you're just in a good mood. That's, I just feel good today. It's, it's good energy. Um, the sun is out. It's not overcast, dreary. The last couple of days been rainy and dreary. It really puts me in a bad mood. It puts me in like a down, not motivated mood. Am I, am I tripping? Am I the only one? Y'all please leave a comment. Let me know if I'm the, if, if weather, does or does not affect y'all on a gloomy day do you feel like it's possible for you to be happy and cheerful or do you like to sleep take naps because you enjoy like overcast days for me i can't do overcast days yo. I, don't, I don't like dreary 
weather. It puts me in a, ugh, put me in a funk. But just finished uh, running some errands and uh, heading back home. Jerry has speech therapy in a little bit, which is awesome. You know, we haven't shared a lot of updates on Jerry and his therapy and Jordan and her her struggles at dance. But uh, I'm happy for both my kids. And I know me and Dee, we've talked about it extensively. We want to be balanced parents, but we're not too over, overly concerned or overly protective over every single thing. So with Jerry, you know, he has areas where it's weaker and Jordan has weaker areas that, you know, I kind of just accept them and embrace them as just a part of, you know, they're not going to do everything perfect. And I don't expect it. I don't want to put pressure on my kids to do everything great, you know. Just let them be, just be kids and just be chill. Don't force the issue on a lot of things. Because a lot of things, a lot of times, that will sabotage the kid. Um, and I think it's just how great my mom was. My mom wasn't a very pushy mother. And I, I just had it in me to be motivated and, and to want to do more and get more out of life. Um, and that wasn't my mom forcing me to do X, Y, and Z. But yeah, he has his speech therapy, which helps him every single week. Jordan, her confidence is growing in dance, but also she has challenges where she has insecurities uh, with kids teasing her. So it's been a theme of, you know, kids teasing. You know, even though our kids are homeschooled, they still get the, the school type of experience. It's not as long, it's not as much time out the day, but it's just around a bunch of kids having, you know, uh, experiences on their own, but yeah, they definitely get, you know, the social aspect for sure. But um, anyway, y'all, I feel good. I just feel good. Smile with me, y'all. Please smile with me. Hopefully you are in a good mood as well. And if you're not, it's just not your time. It's not your season. You know, things go up and down. That's just life. And just try your best to be consistent and as even kill as you can. Don't get too high, don't get too low. It's all good. Beans. You enjoying this, this song? She's like, why'd you stop playing? <laughs> okay. On the way to the park, my big boy. His flag football practice got canceled, so, you know, Coach Daddy had to step in. I'm in full jeans. I could have changed it to my shorts and gave him the business, but you gonna get the business with this one. We're gonna do what it do. Modify that. They can't change that. That light gonna be bright. That light gonna shine regardless. Nothing gonna stop it. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> oh, oh my God. goodness! What is wrong with my family? <laughs> 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 Why did that have to happen? That happen? That from you. Shh! Don't you do know? that. Don't do that. That's my job. Oh my God. Nobody likes your crafty baby. I know. <laughs> I had to do that to mommy. I do the correction to mommy. Yo, we just finished an epic mukbang. Check it out on the Extra Family. Type it on the search bar on YouTube. My name's Beanie, being a good girl, side eyeing me. Like, what's your problem? <laughs> Tore it up. The biscotti was bussing. The chicken, bussing. Gravy. Dry french fries. 
I could go in on uh, Jollibee, but I won't. Jollibee's so good. No, I don't. Huh? You're a hater. Jollibee's good. I'm not a. She only defended them because it's Filipino. It's your heritage and your cousins didn't work it up. That's the only reason. Yeah, exactly. Silence. 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 Who remember that from Martin? But no, I could go in on uh, Jollibee because, you know, they don't rock with me. I don't rock with them. <laughs> the feelings are mutual. Because they don't adhere to customer requests. I'm well versed in fast food places. Everyone can customize, do things for the customer based on my request. Jollibee? No. No. Either you take it how we give it to you or you don't get it at all. Hey. And we don't care if you don't want to come to this company. Hey. So, so it's bump them it and they like said bump me. No, it bees like that. Yeah, because it's your people. You're trying to hold it down. Who's side? Me or Jolly Bee? <laughs> See what I got to deal with? The disrespect. See how long it takes for the answer that? That's offensive. Hey, all That's I offensive. Is, uh, we got leftovers. Of course we got leftovers. <sighs> So my baby, she got some news she shared with me, which, you know, we'll get into later. What? Stay tuned. Uh -huh. What? Serious topics. Did you tell them what you- No, I ain't tell them nothing. Bought me? I'm about to tell them <clears throat> what I bought you. Yeah, the disrespect. I bought you something epic. They just saw it. Could you- What are you talking about? Oh, you showed them what you bought me? Your case cover? No. Anyway, so I'm, we gotta clean this up and we'll see y'all later, y'all. Cause you tripping. The Snickers you got me. Yeah. I'm going to show them that too. I was talking about something else. Oh. All right, now you done made it all the way to the end of the video. Hopefully you enjoy it. Make sure you let me know in the comments down below. What was your favorite part of the vlog? Which was your favorite line that was said in the video? What was the funny part? What was the part that you disagree, you challenged about, you didn't like it? Let me know. Positive and negative comments. I need to see it all. It's only helping us make the content even better. I really appreciate y'all tuning in. I look forward to seeing y'all in the next video. God bless y'all. Peace.